Hello and welcome back to How To Basics and today we're going to keep it simple again and show you how to make perfect roast potatoes. It is really easy and really simple. All you need is some Maris Piper potatoes, uh, some garlic, some fresh rosemary and some oil and of course your seasoning. So to start off with, we've got a pan boiling. All we're going to do is cut our potatoes we've peeled already into nice size, equal sizes. So they cook. If they're not sure on your size, just take one out. That one's the same size, that was a whole. That one in the middle, same with this one, and the same with this one. Well, all the average, same size, sorry, just so they cook at the same times. That means the water's gonna drain at the same time to get those nice fluffy potatoes. So first off, we're gonna boil them off about 10, 15 minutes, just so they're soft on the outside, not too much. And then we'll go from there. Potato has been boiling now for about 10 minutes or so. They're a little bit soft on the outside, so that's the time I'm going to take them out. So I'm going to put them into a drain next to me. You can see some of the parts on the outside are breaking apart. You know it's going to be nice and fluffy in the middle once it's cooled down. And then while our potatoes are draining, we've got our pan of oil here. So we're going to heat this up for 10 minutes in the oven while that's cooling down. And once this is warmed up, put it to the oven quick now. Got the oven at 180, and then with my garlic and my rosemary, is what we use to flavour our potatoes. So three bulbs of garlic. So take them apart. Same with these ones. And then with my rosemary, what I'm going to do is pull my sprigs as they are from the top. Just pull them down to pull off your excess. Put them down from the top of the stem. And this is going to flavour our lovely potatoes. So have some rosemary separate. And then we've got garlic, just as it is, you're just going to slice it. Nothing special, it's just going to flavour that lovely oil for us for our potatoes to sit in. garlic ready to go and your rosemary. Once your oil's warmed up, we'll come back, fluff our, oil, our potatoes in the oil, add a garlic and rosemary and we'll go from there. Right, before I get my oil out of the oven, all I've done is I've chopped up my garlic and my rosemary with one little bunch of rosemary here. I'm just gonna cut this a little bit finer. So that hot oil sticks, this will stick all over your potatoes and get a nicer flavor in there as well. And I've still got some sprigs on there. So let's get the oil out of the oven quickly. This is the quick part, because you want the oil to stay hot, we we'll take it out being very careful because oil will burn you. So in my pan here, I've got some a little bit of salt in there. Just get them covers. I'm gonna put my sprigs of rosemary in there. It's gonna react to the oil straight away. Same with the garlic. And then tip your potatoes away from you, never towards you, because oil's gonna splash onto you. So if anyone's filming, just be careful as well. And then with the rest of your rosemary and your garlic mix, over the top of your potatoes. While that's freezing up, get that into the oven first. Half hour in the oven at 180, and then we'll be back in a couple of seconds, we'll show you the result. Can you hear that? It's those nice crispy potatoes. So I'm just gonna empty mine into a bowl. garlic in there, I can smell it. All you do now is a little bit of salt on top. And just ASMR to prove. Nice, crispy, foolproof roast potatoes to do at home on a Sunday. That's my way of showing you how to do perfect roast potatoes. If that, if that helped you at all, please let us know any other little how-to basics like us to try.